beef them and leave. Catch us live on your TV screen. CPT, what we be? 4 p.m. till 5 every week. XS, 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 CTV family. Catch us live on your TV screen. CPT, what we be? 4 p.m. till 5 every week. XS, 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 XS. show in the motherland to you at home for choosing us as your source of entertainment city by your dog is your mulela i'm sure any good afternoon to you good dog mulweni salam alaikum welcome to you ladies and gentlemen the three musketeers are in the building bringing you nothing but the very best of the youthful entertainment welcome to excel ladies yes and yes because today is Tuesday, is Tuesday. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. already. I don't know what's happening on Wednesday, but she's surely excited for it's tomorrow. <laughs> I'm just putting it out that Wednesday is coming. <laughs> <laughs> we must, there must oh, still be here. No <laughs> but of course, guys, please do let us know how your week is going because it is a Tuesday. We started the week last night. Um, yesterday rather and we want to know what you guys are getting up to what are your plans for the week hit us up on social media platforms are available on facebook instagram whatsapp twitter guys you literally have no excuse not yeah. to get into contact with us we are available on facebook xa live instagram xa underscore live as well on twitter mm -hmm. and this tuesday if i must say <laughs> I really it but yeah, if you want it to be tuesday let it be a tuesday as we already really said um yeah. uh, interact with us on all of our social media uh, social media platforms but for now stay tuned because we'll bring not, nothing but the best of this show mm -hmm. later on the show Louis Demanda is going to be sitting down with Dr. Joetta who has a master's degree and specializes in sports science mm -hmm. business and wellness mm -hmm. I mean one day I please guys I inspire I aspire actually to inspire just like this woman hello TK as well as Lauren Joffel also in the building they'll be chatting to U Bradley Decock who is an entrepreneur and he has trained a lot of people, 150,000 or more, coming from primary schools, high schools, universities, and many, many others. This entrepreneur is doing many um, fears, upper Mzanzi, changing the world, changing mm. the community mm. one day at a time. Speaking of such, there is a game of games! <laughs> Mona Lisa, the picture perfect. We're gonna see who's gonna come out of tops today. So make sure that you do not go anywhere because there's a lot of entertainment. And of course, in the show, we also, I'm also going to be joined by Usine Lizwe Fagate, who is the owner of Rocky Park Farming. And we're gonna be talking about everything that has to do with farming and black people and actually young, the youth, people going into farming and going to the agriculture sector. So you do not want to miss that. So we're making agriculture fashionable exactly, today. Exactly, Hello, exactly, exactly, exactly. And you know that you need to go for your favorite music video of the week today. in Patelo BZ, the boy, as well as Benny Boy. You do not want to miss those music videos. One of them is going to make music video of the week. Rules of engagement. Okay. You hop onto Facebook, Excel Live. Okay. You like and share the page. Right. And then you comment with your favorite artist and the name of that music okay. video. Okay. Right now, it's time for us to head on to some trendy. trendy. underscore live on Twitter as well as on Instagram that number two dial zero two one four four eight zero four four eight or WhatsApp us on zero six zero three nine one eight four six four. On Thursday we're talking queerpedia. Do you know that queer people have rights? Have you ever um assaulted or any derogative um that uh in the LGBTQI um community perhaps you do not um know is in and they are criminal um, on Thursday, we're going to be talking that. That's that is very interesting. I hope you guys do tune in for that. 
But also, in the trending news, a full story for today, protests are still ongoing in South Africa. The um, student um, national parties, or rather political um, student parties, the EFF and the SASCO, have called for a total shutdown of all universities across SA because students are being um, excluded from registering for the academic year of 2021 because of historical debts. And we all know that Imali is a problem here in South Africa, and they're saying that there are funds to fund these students so that they can continue with tertiary education. The problem is that the government is misusing and mismanaging the money that is um, supposed to be used for these students. So we really want to um, ensure, or rather, a call for a free education. Is it possible? Do you guys think that education in tertiary, um, tertiary institutions should be free? Do you think that um, students must make a way, find a way? I don't know, get in touch with us on our social media platforms. We want to hear what you guys have said. But some universities have cleared students for registration. Yeah. So you, I think the students at UCT, UWC have been cleared. So we're hoping that the other universities will also follow suit. Mm. Two questions, two honest questions. Is it fair for those people that um, do have the financial aid, they can go to school, mm -hmm. they can afford to go mm -hmm. and learn, and then about do that are not able to pay for their fees, they disrupt classes. Mm -hmm. Is it fair on those people? Number two, um, why is it easy for government to save state-owned enterprises like OSAA that mm -hmm. are failing, they borrow them billions, OSCOM, money, they give them billions, and then here comes Umona Lisa does not have a tuition fee, yeah. and mm -hmm. Abba mm -hmm. yeah. crazy. Mm -hmm. I mean, it really isn't fair. But also, again, I have a that are disrupting the classes, but more Nabarazo Fatala. I mean, life is not fair if you have to put it at yeah. that um, sense. Because in Yanike, if you can't pay tuition fee, what else other option do you have but to disrupt the class so that they can hear you? Unfortunately, that's just the world that we are living in, especially in South Africa. But in other sad news, um, a hip hop dancer, also known by Tally, was shot down in his in his street um he was from a shop nearby his house and it was shot the gunman is unknown um someone witnessed all of this it is unfortunate because this young man was a promising hip-hop dancer and he believed in uplifting his community i mean mm. it's brutal so What's much violence in south africa it's scary to it's be walking crazy. in the streets because you don't know if you're gonna make it home alive yeah. congratulations to anati for walking out with the grammy for brown skin <laughs> <laughs> but on that note we take a quick ad break when we turn. There's TK, there's Lauren, there's Mithali, there's Mona Lisa, and Lama Mungu. Keep it locked right here on the biggest switch up in the motherland. Welcome to Tuesday. Yes. <laughs> CTV family, catch us.